Hi everybody, today I'm going to be solving a 7x7 seven seven with mittens on, so let's get right into the video. Okay, so I'm going to be solving a 7x7 seven seven with mittens on. This is the YJMGC 7x7. Seven seven. I will link it in the description. It's an amazing cube. You can go watch my mains video if you want to hear more in depth about it. Anyway, I'm going to be solving this with mittens, and this will probably take me a while. I'm going to see how fast it will take me. I suspect it will take me at least 20 minutes because it's just like super hard even to make one turn. But what I'm going to do is I'm going to switch to my solving angle so you get kind of a better view and I don't have to solve in front of the camera so anyway now let's switch to that so i've moved the camera and i'm going to be using a stopwatch since it will probably take me more than 10 minutes so anyway now let's get it scrambled Okay, so anyway, now let's get my mittens on. So I have my mittens on, and let me just go start the solve. Okay, three, two, one, and go. Okay, so I just finished the white center. I believe it's been around a minute or two. And yeah, it feels pretty good to be done, but it's been pretty hard so far and pretty tiring. Okay, so I finished the yellow center. And it honestly was a lot easier than the white center, number one, because there are fewer pieces, but also I was getting more used to turning with my gloves. So yeah, now let's keep going. So I just finished red and green and honestly it went pretty well a lot better than white and yellow because there are fewer pieces and because I'm getting more used to turning. Anyway now let's continue the time lapse. Just about finishing up my commutator here and now I'm done with orange and blue so I'm done with all the centers and again it did go more smooth than all the other centers because a few more pieces and because I was getting more used to the mittens. So I'm now on to last four edges, and honestly I'm very happy about this because the first eight edges honestly were super hard because they for some reason were just harder than the center, so anyway let's keep going. So just one more move and now we're on to 3x3 stage which is such a big relief because the outer layers are much easier to turn than the inner layers. So just finishing up the LLO, and it looks like we have an F perm, so anyway, let's see, let me just go do the F perm. Okay. 
Okay guys, so I got an 849, and it would be a little less than this if I could stop the timer easily, but with the mittens, it's a bit hard. But yeah, honestly, that's really good. I did not expect to get under 20 minutes. I would say the hardest part, honestly, was edge pairing because it's just super hard to turn when you have mittens on. But one interesting thing is that when I turn this now, it literally feels so square. I can't even explain it. You have to do it for yourself. It just feels super weird to touch like anything without mittens. It feels super sharp to me right now and you kind of have to get used to it. Anyway, that was a pretty good challenge. I honestly enjoyed doing it even though it wasn't the best and it was not so fun. I still really enjoyed making this and I hope you enjoyed. Make sure to like, subscribe, and see everybody later. Thank <laughs> you.